Hey guys, this is going to be my favorite winter slash fall lip products. Um, so I hope you enjoy. So let's get started. So I have five lipsticks right here that I love to wear in the winter time. Yeah, Christmas. I love Christmas. If you didn't know that already, I love Christmas. It's my favorite. If I want to wear a nude lip, um, I don't go with the typical nude. I do have a couple, like here, this one or um, like Revlon Soft Nude. I do have those, but um, those aren't really my favorite to wear because I look kind of dead because <laughs> I'm really pale. But um, I actually bought this in New York. This is Max Politely Pink, and this is honestly like a perfect um, luster nude on me. So that's what that looks like. And um, it's my favorite kind of lipstick. It is by MAC, obviously, and it's a luster. So that is my first favorite. For a um, normal pink lip would be um, Bamboo Pink by Clinique, which looks like this. And it looks kind of brownie and kind of gross on my hand, but. The way that it mixes with my lip color, it just makes this perfect pink color that's not too much. And I can wear it with basically any eye look. Um, so I really enjoy this lipstick. Now we're going to get into the deeper lip colors. Here's one that's a little bit more subdued. This is Revlon's Rosy Nude. It is not nude, let me tell you. Maybe if you have a very deep skin tone, this might be nude. But for me, this is a light berry color this one right here. I like this to wear with um, more neutral eye looks. I don't really like wearing dark lips and dark eyes. So, Revlon Rosy Nude. I enjoy this. Okay, getting into the more deeper ones. Yeah! Um, this is also from MAC. This is Viva Glam 4. It is a frosty red berry color with golden shimmer. And it's honestly so gorgeous. I... Um, wore this on Friday to school and a cell phone. This is just one of my favorite colors to wear. I've had this for a while. I love the smell of the la Mac. I love the smell of the Mac lipsticks. Um, vanilla, of course, signature. <laughs> um, so I think this is a great holiday lip color. And then for my darkest color that I have, this is a cream sheen by Mac, and it is in Party Line. This is a super deep color. Um, I was kind of afraid of it at first, but it is super deep berry red, and I honestly love this color. I actually got a dent in it, which made me very upset. These are my five favorite lip colors for the fall and winter. Now I'll move on to lip glosses. First one I'm wearing right now is um, Urban Decay's Lip Junkie Naked, which came with my Naked 2 palette. And I'm not going to swatch these glosses because my hands look at all sticky and gross, but um, this is pretty true to color. It's supposed to be plumping. I don't know if it is, I just like the mint sensation. And it's more of a darker nude, which is what I like to wear in the winter. For an everyday color, I really like MAC Slip Glass in Purr. Um, don't know if you can see that color. Again, awesome vanilla smell. Um, these are very sticky, but they stay on for a long time. So that's why I don't mind the stickiness too much. And this shade is definitely a rose gold color. Um, it is Wet n Wild's Mega Slicks Lip Gloss in rose gold. Huh, who would have thought, right? Um, and these smell like, kind of like cotton candy or something. They smell really good. But um, this one's definitely metallic lip gloss. And it looks really good over neutral. Any of these, actually, it would look good over. And my last one is a lip stain. And this is Revlon's Just Fit and Kissable Balm Stain in Romantic. And it is just a classic red color. Um, I'll swatch this for you. This is more of a tomato red lip balm stain. This is the color. So it doesn't really make your teeth look whiter. But it does stain your lips, I can guarantee that. And I like that it is not super drying on your lips because that like really bothers me. I mean this lip stain actually I do like the NYC 16 hour smooch proof lip stain so um, if you want a good like cheaper one I like the NYC but 
ones I don't really like are, where is it? These Super Stay 24 Hour ones, because these like ball up weirdly on your lips, so I don't recommend this kind. I hope you enjoyed this video. Sorry that I don't make videos super regularly, but I do have a life, so <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, but thank you so much for watching, and if you liked this video, then like and comment and subscribe if you want to, and if not, that's okay too. Anyway, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!